this video, we uncover Iran's newest suicide drone. We explain Hadid 110's speed, stealth, and devastating warhead power. You'll see its unique underwater launch and tactical battlefield role. Finally, we reveal global reactions and strategic implications behind it. Hadid 110 drone was introduced by Iran in February 2025. It was developed by Ministry of Defense and IRGC. The official unveiling occurred at Ektidar 1403 Defense Exhibition. Hadid 110 immediately joined the Payambar Azam 19 exercise. This drone is a jet-powered suicide drone with delta wing design. Its body edges are sharp to enhance radar stealth features. The weight and dimensions were chosen for tactical missions. Unique design significantly reduces the radar cross-section signature. Hadid 110 uses a small turbojet engine for powered flight. This engine makes it faster than propeller-based suicide drones. The drone launches using a booster rocket from the ground. After acceleration, the turbojet engages for continuous flight. The drone's operational range is about 350 kilometers. This range is suitable for striking regional tactical enemy targets. Cruise speed exceeds 500 kilometers per hour consistently. High speed reduces enemy air defense reaction times significantly. Hadid 110 carries a warhead weighing nearly 30 kilograms. This explosive payload is sufficient to destroy valuable enemy assets. Targets include radar sites, air defense batteries, or military facilities. Final detonation delivers destructive impact on designated objectives. Its flight ceiling is approximately 30,000 feet altitude maximum. Such altitude enables evasion of advanced hostile air defense systems. Delta-shaped fuselage also improves stealth against enemy radars. Flight endurance is estimated at nearly one full hour. One unique feature is underwater launch from unmanned submarine. A submersible vehicle can secretly deploy the Hadid drone. This tactic greatly increases element of surprise against enemies. Iran demonstrated this underwater launch capability for the first time. Naval applications of Hadid 110 hold remarkable asymmetric value. Launching underwater makes intersection efforts extremely difficult. Combining submersible drones with fast UAVs creates new threats. This innovation showcases Iranian defense industry maritime advances. Hadid 110 has joined IRGC ground force operational structure. That indicates its missions are mostly tactical battlefield operations. It supports ground operations by striking enemy fortified positions. Speed and surprise make its role highly effective. Domestic media described Hadid 110 as an advanced new drone. Released images show delta wings and booster assisted launch. Analysts highlighted main goal was reducing enemy defense reaction. Stealth and high speed were emphasized as essential features. Foreign media also reacted quickly after the unveiling. Some analysts viewed it as response to regional threats. Reports stressed Iran continues focusing on suicide drone development. This development was seen as part of deterrence doctrine. Military experts underlined the importance of turbojet propulsion. The engine enables rapid arrival at selected enemy targets. However, higher fuel consumption was considered a notable weakness. Nevertheless, high speed increases likelihood of mission success. During exercises, successful launches were publicly confirmed. Ground-based and submarine-based launches were both demonstrated. These tests proved rapid deployment and operational flexibility. Iran's suicide drone capabilities visibly expanded further. 
report suggested lightweight composite materials might be used. Such materials reduce weight while boosting flight speed performance. They also improve resistance under harsh environmental battlefield conditions. Exact technical specifications remain undisclosed by officials. The drone's main mission is striking high-value enemy assets. Targets include command centers, advanced systems, or critical facilities. Its surprise strike capability is vital within deterrence strategy. IRGC considers it a complement to missiles and crews. Hadid 110 exemplifies Iran's continuous progress in UAV technology. Emphasis on loitering munitions shows shift in battle doctrine. From a military perspective, the combination of speed and stealth matters. These elements strengthen Iran's asymmetric warfare posture. International observers expressed concern about balance implications. Regional countries assess countermeasures against such advanced weapons. High speed and underwater launch create significant defensive challenges. Air defense systems must be upgraded accordingly. Iran announced production had entered mass manufacturing stage. This shows determination to expand national deterrence capabilities. Developing multiple suicide drone families creates layered attack options. Hadid 110 forms a crucial part of this arsenal. Since unveiling, additional technical details remain largely scarce. Past patterns suggest future variants will appear rapidly. Likely improvements include extended range, accuracy, and guidance. This path outlines evolving future for Hadid 110 system. Hadid 110 represents integration of technology and new tactics. High speed, stealth, and underwater launch define key features. This mid-range drone plays vital role within IRGC doctrine. Its unveiling reflects continuation of Iran's drone development trajectory.